All right. Time for real time. Start the clock. I appreciate it. The subtitles are always off. It can't just happen in eclipse. There have to be a million conspiracy theories about an eclipse. Oh, God, yeah. Uh, shocking news of the week. O.J. Simpson died yesterday because he had just posted a video saying that he felt great. It, it makes you wonder if there was anything else he ever lied about. <laughs> Because I don't know if you saw what's going on in Arizona. Anybody here from Arizona? Uh, of, uh, Not a single age? soul. <laughs> <laughs> so fragile, hey, so William Shatner. Live with the national That's the man right there. The, Kennedy Center. the man, the national treasure, the legend, William Shatner, ladies and gentlemen. Guy's like 90 years old, man. Looks way younger. Went to outer space and everything, man. Make Biden look Look at that good. guy, man. Uh, Last time I talked to you, you were just had just come back from space. Yes. Right. Uh, <laughs> I like nothing. Since then, you have swam. <laughs> now you're going to Antarctica, I hear? Uh, the uh, Christmas uh, week, uh, Antarctica, the voyage of a lifetime. Uh, it's going to be fantastic. What the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> it's, uh, it's to the Antarctic. Yeah, I know what it uh. is. That's why I don't want to go. <laughs> oh, but there's all kinds of things you've never seen before. After this show, you don't know that a car isn't going to hit you. <laughs> or answer. some big guy who says you've said enough, bang, right on the head. <laughs> <laughs> but I was talking more about your personality and whether yes. it was shaped by that character or were was it in your character and they recognized that when you auditioned and they went, that's a guy, that's a boldly going guy. <laughs> I want, I want to ask boldly going? Not about me leaving the studio. You talk about that you, when men landed on the moon, which is July 20th, 1969. Ooh, look at you. Well, <laughs> <laughs> uh, history buff. Well, I mean, that's what happens when you, when you uh, live work long hard. Yeah. yeah. And live long. Um, and prosper. <laughs> you have to say that. I mean, you don't look nearly your age. 93? I, I, I mean... Man, 93. I, I, I don't mind... I don't mind that you say my age, you know. But when they clap... <laughs> I have been plugging other people's books on this show for 20 years. Now it's my turn. <laughs> And it comes out on May 21st, where you can pre-order it now from, I guess, Simon and... Come Jim. on, you should have released it on uh, books. Okay. April so 20th. Let's get to... William Shatner is 34 years older than me and looks younger than me. <laughs> yeah. You go to Gaza right now and you chant death to Hamas. See how many seconds you live. Right? <laughs> then you might realize... Yeah. I mean, they gave back Gaza in 2005. They did land for peace and they got no peace. They've been rocket attacked ever since and just lived with it. What other country would do that? He always brings that up, but he never, ever brings up the fact that um, the illegal settlements. And then he brings up how they elected, air quote, elected Hamas. Who was running against them, number one? And number two, how do you know if it was really a fair election? I think they're both wrong, Israel and Hamas, but the ones who are suffering are the um, regular everyday Palestinians. And maybe even regular everyday Israelis. He said, and then the council said, your messages of extremism do not resonate with us. Thank you, sir, or council, whoever said that. That's what happened. Yeah, to he happen. deserves a okay. Cahoney well, Award. Change the whole thing about what you could do if you get pissed off at something, write a letter. To the person who pisses you off, or maybe just to the... You know he's going to make a little segment out of this, like a little joke, a bit. Get it out on paper. So I sent out a team of investigators. Here we go. <laughs> Jesus Christ, every time I pick up a guitar now, Meathead thinks I'm writing a joke about it, a song about it. Fuck that one up. <laughs> Nobody ever talks about all our planes where the goddamn doors don't fall off. <laughs> <laughs> There's only one guy in this whole freaking country who has to get on a plane by walking up a giant flight of stairs in front of everybody. You try it, assholes. <laughs> P. Diddy, we got into his garbage. Uh, hey, oh, wow, the, oh, the audience. He was 14. Where were the tanks on Elvis's lawn? Well, that's 
Uh, for, lo- for the love of Christ, you feeble old fuck, it's Kamala, not Koala. Oh. <laughs> koala. <laughs> hey, mushroom dicks. <laughs> From, oh, Donald Trump. Uh, he wrote, uh, Bill Maher is a low ratings, no charisma, whack job. And for the record, my dance moves do not look like me jerking off two guys at once. Ah, you're the this idea that you could be a biological male and trans, and I have full respect for trans people, absolutely. I want them to have fairness and equality in life, but not when it erodes the women's rights. Right. Fairness and equality. That's why I stand with J.K. Rowling. Rowling. What do you think about OJ? <laughs> <laughs> it was a miscarriage of justice, but for white people to be that upset mm. about the one time the one time. A black <laughs> the one guy time. Got Do you think he did it? This was of right. course he did it. <laughs> of course. No that he did it. Or he hired but someone to do it. But that wasn't the issue. And the jury knew it too. Mm. Yeah. It was payback. Even people today, younger people, maybe they didn't have anything terrible that happened to them, but they're like, yeah, but I know what you did to my grandfather. Mm. And that was some shit. And I loved him. So I'm mad mm. for him. Yeah. It's not going to go away in my lifetime or yours, you know. All of that is true, but let's not lose sight of the fact that in the day there was a terrified woman who got murdered. Yes, that's true too. And that should not be forgotten. And that was a that's true too. Miscarriage of justice. Karen, no, I'm kidding. <laughs> <laughs> no, no. There are all young people who are constantly taking pictures with their phone must be sentenced to six months with an old school camera. Oh man, hell yeah. That's right, you only have 24 pictures and you won't get them back for two weeks. Yep. Now who wants to take pictures of their food? (laughs) Right. (laughs) My favorite is when someone says, what was I just talking about? Oh, I don't know, something so boring even you stop paying attention? Man, Bill Maher does that all the time on uh, Club Random. We should follow the advice good liberals have given for decades and learn from other countries. Especially <laughs> the unemployment rate in the U.S. is 3.8 percent, and in Canada it's 6.1. Whoa! And of the 15 North American cities with the worst air pollution, 14 are in Canada. I'm not citing these stats because I have it out for Canada. I love. What about Canada. Mexico? And That's uh, North, North America too. <laughs> and because of mortgage debt, Canada has the highest debt to GDP ratio of any G7 nation. I don't know what that means, but it sounds bad. <laughs> <laughs> whose pronouns are she, her, and those. <laughs> Kayla is now back to being a guy named Kerry, but two years ago when they showed up to teach children, the progressive high school they taught at said that they, they, the school, not the person. <laughs> Man. What about the equipment in that shop class? <laughs> To which liberals say, blaming immigrants for the rising crime rate is racist. Yeah, but is it true? Of Hmm. course it's true. It's not a coincidence the quality of life went down after the Somali gangs started a drug turf war using hand grenades. Man. Racist doesn't solve the problem. It hands future elections to someone who will solve the problem and who, I promise, you're not going to like. All right, that's our show. I'll be at the end of the show in Salt Lake. April 21st, Arizona. Catch on the next one.